Welcome back to another Jeep video, guys. We're heading today to go pick up a, look, it's like a 2000 Jeep Wrangler, 114 ish thousand miles. Supposedly it runs all ready to go, it just has a bad frame. So uh, it's, a, it's a parts vehicle, but hopefully it has the good parts that we need a good hard top by the looks and a good window frame. And uh, supposedly it runs and drives under that, it just has the bad frame. It's actually still inspected for another six months or so. So uh, it's, it's pretty cold today. It's about negative 11 now when I woke up this morning. Uh, it's still early, it's only 8 o'clock in the morning, so heading up to get the trailer and get that, and then uh, we'll head on our way, about a 45 minute drive to go pick up this Jeep, and uh, we'll get back with you guys in a little bit. Sucks to be him. Let's get the trailer hooked up, and then we'll be heading that way. Let's get our come alongs, power pack, figure we grab the little propane torch. Uh, got a half inch impact, little bottle jack, gloves, I don't know, I got a socket set. So we should be good to go. All my lights are coming on because it's so freaking cold out. Check my tire pressure, but it says it's low. <clears throat> ABS light's been on for a while. It's a Ford, needs some work. Sorry for the road traffic, we're at a gas station. Just left this guy's um, shop. We got the Jeep. <clears throat> Getting ready to head home now. Got it all loaded, it's 2,000, 800 bucks. It is rusty, <laughs> but we already knew that going into it. Got a really nice top and a really nice uh, window frame. Tires don't look bad, doors look good, uh, rear windows, so should be a lot. Standard shift, four wheel drive works. Uh, the only thing is he sold the Cadillac converter, but he had that in the Facebook thing, so. But we're ready to haul. Got a good back window, so that's, that'll be nice for the cab. Just pulled into the store to double check our chains, and then we're gonna head about 45 minutes home. Well, let's see if I'm recording here. I made it, we made it home. Well, not home. We're just dropping the trailer back off. Runs, I put it in four low, uh, put it in four high, and then I put it in uh, two high. Just unloaded and stuff, just does work. Brakes work. As you can hear, it's loud. Doesn't have a Cadillac converter on it. Yeah, I don't know if the winch works. The guy said he wasn't sure. Has a soft top in the back. The tires look decent. Uh, hard to tell how good it runs, but when you listen in the engine bay, it actually sounds, I don't hear any ticks or anything. So 100 and, oh, where are you here? 114,000. Interior looks really clean. So this is the hard top we need. So yeah, the brakes work. Uh, other than the frame, it's actually not too bad. Obviously it's rusty, but. So we're, we're turning the trailer real quick. It's a borrowed trailer, so. Get that back and then uh, we'll get it up to dad's house. Maybe we'll take a closer look. So I think since the catalytic converter is off, it's, uh, you let it idle for a few minutes, it runs a little rough, then you give it a little gas. Of course, we don't know what's got for gas in it. The guy said he did use it at the, he had like a little car shop or I think he snow plowed for people and stuff and sold cars here and there. But um, he said he used it to push cars and shit in the shop and stuff. So I don't know how long it's been sitting as far as how good the gas is in it. Other than that, it runs pretty good. I just drove it up through. There's like a little back, like a four wheeler trail, it's half plowed. But it crawled up through there pretty nice. Got a little CD player here, but the battery is dead, dead. So we're gonna let it run here for a few minutes. And uh, I don't know, so we find any treasures, I guess. You never know, sometimes you find tools or change or something. But yeah, so we got it home and we'll uh, do a little closer look here in a little bit. We'll see where, where we go from here. Got the back opened up, the shocks aren't very good, but the window or the rear window is about perfect. These things are kind of goofy, but like for parts, if you ever need a kill light lens or something does have a hitch, kind of good, came with a receiver too, so that belongs to me now. Well, it did come with a soft top, so when we take this one off, I was just telling Dad, we'll, we'll take it off and we'll put it right back, put the soft top on, just to save on it. But yeah, that's about it. Maybe I'll do another update video on the other one. Still pretty cold out. Dad wanted to take it for a little spin around just to see how everything feels. Too bad the frame's back because the interior is in really nice shape. Be a nice little vehicle for like a young kid or something. Well, four wheel driving stuff works. Looks like it had a little bit of a leak. I don't know if it's remain sealed or if it's uh, might be a little further back. I can't really, couldn't really tell at the shop. The guy put it indoors last night for us. Real nice guy. He put it indoors last night so it was nice and warm. And it was just easy to jump the battery and stuff from inside. But you know, the guy was honest with us and stuff, and 
like he said he had a lot of people on Facebook that were interested said uh, you know wanted wanted to buy parts so if we ever wanted to part it out we could uh, be a good business again to part them out but not not buying them around here they're just not in good enough shape wow it's cold truck truck hauls good this has got the 5.4 on it so it doesn't have very, many, very much power but yeah it hauls real nice be almost a shame to tear it apart but we're we're gonna do something with it they turn into like a little doodle bug or something use it as parts for lights and tires and stuff like that and then turn it into like a little doodle bug or something like that got dad about talked into it but anyway thanks for watching guys thanks for coming along with our little adventure too bad it wasn't a little warmer out could have got a little better video and stuff but man it's just cold we're happy to get home happy to find it been looking for a hard top for a long time so we'll catch you guys in the next one and uh maybe we'll you guys will see an update on the uh the jeep truck